All right, so let's take what we've done. Vamos a avanzar. Pick a little area like this. You notice I'm just making a couple of small areas that come in from the left here. Unas áreas pequeñas, pero en la izquierda, just a little. Okay, now pick another more, a couple more. Make sure the lines look like the old lines. Asegura que las líneas parezcan a las originales. You notice I'm making kind of triangular little areas there. And areas, uh, triangulas, triangulares, that's what we're looking for. Okay, make these lines look like the other ones. Que las líneas parezcan a las otras, a las originales. Just a couple of small areas of dark. Unas áreas pequeñas, no muy grandes. We're just adding a little darkness there, okay? Pero ya parece a un árbol, no? It already kind of looks like a tree. Okay, keep the lines the same. Grupos de líneas aquí. But more on the left, más a la izquierda. Because we have to think about the light direction, no? La dirección de la luz, no? The cool thing is how much we can get by just suggesting. Podemos sugerir con muy, muy poca información, pero la mente lo llena. La mente uh, hace lo, el resto. Your mind actually just creates the rest of the detail once you start on a thing like this. So on this one, we're going to continue. Do you notice these aren't all as dark? Unas oscuras y unas más ligeras. I'm kind of trying to keep the pressure varying, but you look how I'm doing this. More on the left, right? Y a la izquierda más oscuras también. This one's going to be weird. Esta será rara. But try and pick small areas that are more or less just a little part heading in. Un poco a la izquierda y... Okay. And then maybe a little. Okay. In this one, we're just going to emphasize a couple of these lines a little more. Líneas así. Did you notice how I'm making these so that they fade out? They're sharper at the end. Con mucha presión empezando y menos presión después. Okay, on this one, just some more areas of light, of some little dark areas. Unas areas. Just have them stick in from the left. Que, pare, que empiecen a la izquierda. Así. But keep the lines looking like the ones you already drew. Que las líneas se parezcan todas. And you can see how that's a pretty, that already looks like a tree. Ya parece a un árbol, ¿no? I'm not sure exactly what, I, oh yeah, the globes. Es como un grupo de globos ahora, ¿no? And then we're going to go ahead and darken the trunk there. If you've only taken it this far, you're okay for Monday's class. But please do have it this far so that we can continue to develop. Because Monday, I'm going to put some new tools in the hands of those of you who are here. All right. You can continue to do little things like this if you like to. Puede, si se puede continuar un poco. You can add a little bit more. Añadir un poco de enfasis, más detalles. You can put more details in. You can see how that's starting to look like something that's kind of round and dark on the left side, though, no? Parece un poco a un globo todo. And we can continue adding texture like this for a little while longer if you like, but keep the pressure light. Que la presión sea todo ligera. And we will see you again el Monday, el lunes, to develop these further para desarrollar más. See you later.